Hello and welcome to Brainy Gardener. Today, it is all about how to grow and care watermelon peperomia plant. Watermelon peperomia is an evergreen perennial shrub. The plant is native to Brazil and Ecuador, but is being grown as an ornamental house plant worldwide. It is also sometimes called watermelon begonia, as the leaves share some resemblance to begonias and watermelons. This semi-succulent shrub has oval leaves 3 to 4 inches long and 1 to 3 inches wide. They are deep green with silver veins that strongly resemble the white markings on a watermelon, hence the name. Their stems are colored blood red, providing a striking contrast to the leaves. Watermelon peperomia is easy to grow and care. As long as you stick to the proper care routine, there's very little that can go wrong. Here's how you get started. It grows best in medium light while being protected from direct sunlight. It can even tolerate very low light conditions for a long time but don't consider this their preference. Aesthetically, these plants rarely serve as centerpieces when placed in a garden. Instead, their distinct, bright green leaves are better suited to accentuating other, more striking plants. Therefore, complementing this perennial with others that share similar needs is a great way to increase the value it brings to your garden. Its small size makes it perfect as a desktop plant, something to consider if you're redecorating the office. Watermelon begonia should be watered moderately and consistently in the growing season. Before watering, Make sure that the top layer of soil has dried out. This plant is native to the tropics and prefers warm, wet environment. Temperature of about 65 to 80 degrees Fahrenheit is optimal. However, it can tolerate cold down to about 50 degrees Fahrenheit. This plant requires moderate to high humidity levels to thrive. The plant will not do well in dry conditions and can suffer from leaf drop, wilting, and even death if the humidity levels in its environment are too low. Fertilizing watermelon begonia is not necessary, but if you choose to do so, use a balanced liquid fertilizer every other week from spring to summer. The recommended method for propagating watermelon peperomia is by way of leaf cuttings. Stem and tip cuttings can also work, but most people stick with leaf cuttings as the tried method. This plant can also be propagated using seeds, but propagation by cuttings is easier with a higher chance of success. Watermelon peperomia can be potted in a wide variety of containers, depending on your preference. When potting, make sure to use a well-draining potting mixture. This is a slow-growing plant that rarely needs repotting. In fact, it prefers being pot-bound most of the time. This is a non-toxic plant and is completely safe to be around. Most common pests of this plant are spider mites and mealybugs. Both are sapsuckers that can cause significant damage to the plant if left unchecked. Use cotton balls with alcohol on the affected areas of the plant. 